Hey guys, I'm back with a new video today, and today's video will be about first looks with the gorilla. And so, here's the gorilla, and it's you can bypass gates, so it can't bypass walls though. Um, it does 20x damage to buildings and walls. But I don't think it ever attacks a wall. Most of the time, it actually just goes around through the gate usually. So you'll kind of see that because I I tried it a couple times so far, and that's usually what happens. Um, if you see how much, that's basically 20 times the damage right there is 20, uh, 2880. So, I'd use these troops so far, as long as they don't get overwhelmed by, like, defenders, basically, as long as they don't get caught by the garrisons or the cavalry. Basically, you need to keep your Gatling guns or your Lancers nearby, so you should rally them often to kind of protect them. And they have, uh, 2145 hit points. And it's 15 true space, so they definitely take up a lot of true space. Just three of them take up 45 by themselves. So what we're gonna do is, uh, let's see, let's get an armor blessing. I wish I. Um, anyways, I don't think that no, that should be fine. And I think a good thing I I forgot that they did like they they made this a lot better protect. So it actually lasts for 40 seconds and it reduces by 50 percent. That's a lot. And so basically, if you combine that with the armor blessing. You're doing, you're saving a lot of hit points, so it'll be really useful against ballista towers and the catapults if they're attacking my troops. So let's get to it. So this is what we're gonna use. We're gonna use a knight a lancer, a three. That's just three infantry units to try to three fusilers to kind of take up the rest of the space. One wall miner just in case if the lancers can't break through easily. Four gatling guns and three gorillas. And so let's let's do this. Okay, so what I'm gonna look for, I'm gonna try to find a harder base, not not like a super easy base or anything like this is really easy, I would destroy that, even without the gorilla. So good thing about the gorillas, they don't get attacked by buildings, which is nice. Um I think I could destroy this and then not take so much not take so many casualties either. So this is what I'm gonna do. First, uh which side should I attack from? Okay, I'm going to attack from this side over here because they have a castle and there's a catapult. So I want to get rid of those first. Um, and then put the fusers out and put Gatling guns to protect everything else. And you see how they detonate it and it goes BAM. Look at that, nice. Okay, I'm going to rally back my troops just in case. I don't think I need a wall miner yet, so it should be fine. They're gonna be able to break through right here. See the destruction. Okay, you see that? They're definitely just going in, but I gotta watch out because they're gonna get attacked. So I definitely need to bring my Gatling guns in here. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Save. I gotta save the gorillas. They d definitely do a lot of damage. You see that Ex exploding? That so? Come on, Gatling guns, get in here, protect my gorillas. Nice. There. That's all you gotta do. And basically, as long as we can protect them from the defending troops, they're gonna do a lot of damage. Lots, lots of damage. Oh no, they're gonna get attacked. Because they actually take a, a quite a bit amount of oil, so that's not the best option on every time. Okay, still, I haven't lost any troops besides infantry, and I think I lost one Lancer, so it's all good. I mean, I'm not really. This is not a hard base in any standard. Yeah. Okay. So what we got? What do we got left? Oops. Do you guys ever do that where you have like your thing on rally and you accidentally rally them by accident? Um. I guess I took all the defensive buildings out. I don't see anything else. Oh, there's one. Ah, uh, there's one thing all the way in the back. Ah, uh, dang! Spike trap took out one of my um, gorillas. I think they'll be able to destroy this before... Yeah, there should be two of them, so yeah, nice. Okay, so... I think I could have done it even more efficiently, actually, if I... If I didn't actually get hit by that spike trap. The spike trap actually just did the most damage to any... Compared to anything else. But yeah, you see these? They just... It's basically, they walk through, they detonate, and then they just keep going. But, yeah, you saw them, they got attacked by the troops, so you kind of have to watch out for that. Just in case. See, they look really cool. They're just kind of like exploding everything. Little bomb. 
nice. I really like this troop. I think it can be really useful, but maybe later on it's gonna be a little bit difficult on a higher level basis because you know these these troops can't stand up to defenders and when you get up to the higher levels, they start putting out a lot more defenders, like garrisons and stuff like that. So it's gonna be a problem at the higher stages. Like right there, we gotta watch out. Yeah. Luckily the Gatling gun was right next to them, but I mean if they weren't, they would have been screwed, so. Uh, let's attack this food thing to get the rest of the food. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. I'm really liking the, the gorilla so far. I mean, it's definitely different, you know? Something that can bypass through gates and does a lot of damage, like 20x damage, that's a lot. And so, I lost to see. One Gatling gun, two infantry. That shouldn't take too long. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. Let's see. How much does it cost for crowns to replace a Gatling gun? Uh, gorilla, sorry. Three? Yeah, I might as well. And. Might as well just keep, like, get two more infantry. I mean, it's not a big deal. It's, just, it's like five crowns. I mean, I can earn that back with, uh, gold. So, let's try to find a little bit harder one. Oh, wait, Dan. I need to go back. Just have an armor blessing just in case. It really does help out a lot when you're find these kind of bases any kind of base definitely if you have the you know trade goods for it definitely get blessings they help out a lot you know and you gotta protect your um trade goods if you see now like i'm actually underneath that remember i had that bug where it was like 50 50 trade goods or something like that or 40 trade goods and now i'm back to like normal now because i've gotten attacked so much and i haven't got a chance to play a lot so Yep, this is the result. So I kind of got back to normal. Oh wait, I'm sorry guys. I don't know if I did an armor blessing. I hope you guys saw it. I don't know if I did or not. I think I did. Well, I'm sorry, I want to double check. Because I, I wanna, I'm want i planning to hard, uh, fight a harder base. So, yeah, okay. And, yeah, we don't have... I, wanted, I wish I could get the weapon blessing. I just don't have a diamond for it. Okay, let's get going. So, do you guys like the gorilla so far? Do you guys want to see all gorilla raid? You know, I, I'll definitely make that video too. And so, I just kind of wanted to show you guys what the gorilla is like. Um, see if I can find a little bit harder base. Sorry. Okay, I mean, this is it's not a hard base. It's just, it has a lot of loot. I kind of want the loot though, but uh, let's find a harder base. It's, it's okay. I just don't want to go through so many bases where we're not going to fight anything. Okay, this is level 83. This is a Lightman Age. So let's figure out what we're going to do first. This uh, this uh, Ballista Tower is going to be uh, quite annoying because it doesn't have gates. So I can't, uh, the gorilla just can't go in and attack it. So I'm going to need to figure out where I attack from. I think I'm going to attack over here where the Colosseum is because there's a tower. And luckily this Ballista Tower I don't have to worry about. Okay, so let's put out all the Lancers. And let me put the, let's put that out. And let me send out. Let me send out Wall Miner. I don't want to send out the Gorilla too early because there's still a lot of troops right now. So maybe in a bit I will send them out. Uh, let me send them over here. Okay, I'm gonna send out the Gorilla now. They can actually go by themselves over here because there's no defending troops over there, so we should be fine. Okay, so the Gatling guns are taking care of it. The Lancers are kind of getting beat up a little bit. Um, let me stop these three because that Ballista Tower is doing a lot of damage to my Lancer. Okay. Yeah, the Gorilla is doing a lot of work by themselves. As long as I take care of the defenders, everything's all good. It's all good. Okay, let me attack this. Okay, I need to... Let me use Protect to protect the rest of them because 40 seconds for only 50% damage, that's pretty good. We need, to, we need to protect that. Oh wow, these gorillas are doing great, doing great. Ah. Uh, that ballista tower. Okay, this tower is left. I took out that. I think 
Yes, okay, good. The gorilla, let's see how much what damage it does against the wall. Okay, it does about like a fourth damage. Yeah, because the walls have about, let's see, 10,000 HP, uh, 10,000 hit points, so definitely just, oh no, gotta watch out. Gotta get back over here, because those troops will do a lot of damage. Okay, good. That's, a, I mean, ambush traps, oh man, that's one thing I want to talk about too. So ambush traps, spike traps, you know, um, let's see the other one, uh, caltrops, they cost so much, like, to repair. Mine are all max level now, and if I, I haven't repaired them in a long time. You know why? Because if I repair all of them, it's 100k just to replace it all, uh, repair them all. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's not, I don't know if that's worth it really. Anyways, this is doing a really great job. I barely, I only lost Lancers and I lost my wall miner and two infantry. That's, that's awesome. Um, this is a decent base. It wasn't like a super hard base in any standard either, but I did take it out. And I mean, I barely any casualties. I used protect, used the sabotage. Very helpful. Kept, uh, kept me from losing more ballista towers. A lot of people are doing that nowadays. I see how they're kind of protecting their ballista tower within the wall, which is probably a good option. Anyways, I hope you guys are liking the grill. You see that? It's just throwing ball, throwing bombs down, waiting for them to detonate. It's awesome. Uh, three star, not bad. I mean, I don't, know, I don't know. I think I'm doing decent. It's not like the best I could do, but it's not the worst. Definitely, it's definitely a good first look. That's what I want to say. I mean, I'm not. I don't think I'll get better with gorillas, but I really hope you guys are enjoying this video so far. Um. I don't know, let me see if I can get, let me see how much Lancer's gonna, I need a couple more Lancer's. Yep, and, huh, it's probably gonna take a while, I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, I'm probably gonna do an all Gorilla Raid soon, and let me know what you guys think, and I hope you guys like these videos, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.